Hello, my name is Priyanka and I am pursuing Master of Science in Chemistry from NIT Hamirpur. So, if we talk about National Institute of Technology Hamirpur, since it is lying in Himachal Pradesh, as you all know, so as Himachal is full of beauty, so the need and the environment of NIT Hamirpur is quite peaceful and beautiful. Also, it is well maintained. You will see all the nature around an idea of a campus. The whole campus is really, really amazing. You have so many facilities. You have good library, reading halls, which we'll talk about later, um, which we'll talk later. So, first of all, if we, we have talked about campus, if we talk about uh, the syllabus that we taught, we have taught in first and second semester, um, yes, it is quite similar to NAT and GATE syllabus. Uh, the topics that we have studied in uh, first and second semester are quite similar to that of NAT and GATE syllabus. Also, our teachers teach those topics which um, quite often come in the uh, NAT and GATE exams. They discuss about that and the previous year questions from them. I'm not saying they only teach um, the NAT and GATE syllabus. They cover the whole syllabus, but they will focus on that point, which hopefully are often asked in that exams. Mm -hmm. So this is what syllabus. And next, if we talk about the semester fees, so I have paid uh, twenty nine thousand five hundred rupees in the first semester, uh, only the semester fees, not hostel. And if we talk about the second semester, I have paid twenty one thousand. 500 or something. This is about the semester fees. Um, if we talk about hostel facilities is offered or not, so yes, the answer is yes, the hostel facilities have been offered for both girls and boys. If we talk about girls, hostel the facilities are quite good. Uh, and I'm also satisfied from everything. We have been offered the hostels from living to the food. Everything is available and everything is full of convenience. You will not find any kind, kind of problem in the hostel. So yes, hostel facilities are amazing too. And campus culture, I have already told, um, talked about. It's very peaceful and full of nature. If you are a nature lover, then NIT Habitpur is for you. So next question we have uh, the services that are available, which also I have forgot about the hostel fees. Hostel fees, if we talk about hostel fees, then for this first semester, I have paid rupees 40,000 for hostel. And for the second thousand, we paid 25,000. And it kept changing every semester because of the menu and everything. Next, we have the services available, which will help the student. In field of research. So, let's see, I don't see any special, you know, services that have been offered to us for the research or something. We have been performing in the labs only the experiments that are mentioned in our syllabus. We are not doing anything special for the research or something. But yes, I'm sure if you are interested in research, Yes, obviously, I'm also interested in research. But if you want to know more about research, you can talk to our research associate we have. And also from the professors, they will, they will always welcome, they always welcome what are your queries and everything. So I don't honestly see any kind of research or services to us, you know. It is nothing like that. And next, we have extracurricular activities. So yes. Extracurricular activities are there. We have this recently, we have, you know, formed form this, what we call Rasainika, the Society of Chemistry. And all the activities are performed on the name of that society. And recently we had this uh, chemistry quiz. And I'm sure upcoming days there will be more activities and we can take part in many fests also from Manali Amirpur. So yes, extracurricular activities are there and you will definitely enjoy it. Placement. If we talk about placement. So our seniors have been placed in Akash Institute by 
so gosh, white trips or whatever. And then, and so striped companies came, you know, and uh, from industry, I haven't heard any placement or something. But yes, Akash and Alan. Um, next, if we talk about placement, so it has also been uh, mentioned that maybe more companies will be interested in the upcoming years and so maybe from um, an art placement will take place, then more companies will be there. So yes, in educational institutions, there is placement. Okay, how does the department facilitate for PhD or job options? Uh, honestly, I don't know about job opportunities because I haven't seen any kind of such notices for jobs and all. But yes, for PhD students, there are PhD scholars and they're working there in their labs and professors are quite helpful to them. They are quite helpful to us. PhD scholars, you can ask them anything. So yes, they are doing their job as well. PhD. Time is available. So if you will ask me that, how is the time table? So I'm gonna say it's quite hectic sometimes because you have to stay in the department from nine a.m. to six p.m. From nine a.m. to one p.m. There is your classes and from 1 to 2 you have to lunch and 2 to 6 you have to attend labs. We have 3 labs, physical, inorganic, organic in a week. And which is quite big for me because and you have to manage on your own for the timetable if you want to prepare for some uh, examination. So yes, um, it's sometimes get hectic but you have to manage. You have to manage there. Uh, if you will manage everything properly, then things will work out. This advantage is, uh, I don't see such any such disadvantage of NID Hamirpur, honestly. I mean, so yes, there are disadvantages. But you have to manage. They are providing you all the facilities. You have, uh, if we, if say that we can't we are not getting time for uh, preparing for such examination but you, you, know, you have to manage they have provided your library professors are also quite helpful you have reading holes you please get your privacy in the reading holes you know you have been provided with um, small cabins and you can study yeah yeah so no such like it. It's not if you if you like. There could be one disadvantage that I have heard from many of my friends, which are from UP or not other places. That they always say that uh, there is no so kind of city area. It's uh, around any Hamirpur. There is city, but it's not that big that you could say in Lucknow or New York or somewhere. So it's quite low-key or something you will not find everything sometimes it gets a little inconvenient about uh, the transportation and something because it's a hilly area it's not that oftenly sometimes it happens sometimes so yes mm. i think one thing i have forgot about faculties so we have seven to eight faculties in department of chemistry physical inorganic organic and also we have a research associate. Mm. Faculties are quite motivating and they are always there to help you. Mm. I'm not saying all the faculties are amazing, but yeah, one or two you can see everywhere there is some kind of people. But yes, overall, um, good faculties are there. Community members are there and they are always helpful. You can talk to them anytime. You can call them, you can mail them, whatever. They never refuse to help you. Uh, and uh, last but not least, I definitely see myself happy here because the first thing that makes me happy about NIT Hamirpur is the campus. It's really beautiful. Since I am Himachali, so I love all these things and I, I love being close to nature. So if you want to be, if you would like, Nature and at a campus is really amazing. 
ऑल्सो डिपार्टमेंट इज थर्ड डिपार्टमेंट इज कोल्ड 